An unlocked door means that occasionally you might get a devil coming in. But a locked door means like a thousand angels walk by. That's that power the media has to influence how you think and feel. And if Time Warner could limit my internet access, that is the beginning of like, wow, I, I'm living in an Orwellian nightmare. The man is not controlling the vertical, the horizontal, the channel that you're going to be on. Well, there's a diversity of voices. There's just a handful of ventriloquists behind them. Most people are told it's a bad boogeyman and there are bad people that want to do bad things to you. And that's bogus. They want to not only be the provider of the content, they want to be the only provider of your content. A much more dangerous and much more sort of insidious threat is not what they're taking away now because we all get so mad about that. Rather, it's what they would like to build and we'll never know what could have happened. It's a powerful, powerful entity. How do I know? Because Comcast, Verizon, and AT&T want to own it. They cannot own it. It belongs to the people. I believe in business. The process of business is going to work this out. What we're really fighting for is the right to know, which I think is an inalienable human right. And there are plenty of ways to make money on serving the right to know, besides trying to make knowledge scarce. He who controls the information is going to control the people. I couldn't share the music that I wanted to share. What other voices are being stilled by that?